That scratch looks painful. So I scratch my face. Are you supposed to put peroxide though immediately on like an open wound like that? Did I put peroxide on it? I think you went inside and put peroxide on it, didn't you? I think you're supposed to use peroxide to clean out like a cut. Oh. You tell us. Is that true? Hello. Hello. Good morning. We're starting early this morning. It's 9.39. And today is the launch. Of Cozy Co. <laughs> It's Earth Day, April 22nd. Who knows, we could be sold out by the time this launches. So cool would that be? There'll probably be some for you guys to buy if you hurry. You <laughs> can pause this video and go check out shopcozyco.com. Uh -huh. Exactly. Timmy is currently wearing the dad sweatshirt, completely inspired by him, in a medium right now. I think he's going to get a large. I'd wear a large. Mm -hmm. This is a medium, but it fits nicely. Size. I just wanted to wear something. I'm so happy you did. It's great. And I'm wearing my like kind of off the shoulder. It, it, it can be. It can be a little bit of like an 80s situation or just regular. I'm not wearing a bra right now, which is cool about the sweatshirt because like no one would even know. My new thing also is just to wear like nipple covers and no bra. It's very comfortable. And then, and, and it still gives your boob a shape. Yeah, that's a great Tips tip. All around. It's a great tip. We've got three nipple covers <laughs> on Amazon. <laughs> Timmy finished my card and he was like, oh, I think I uh, erased your nipple covers out of the card. I was like, did you, did you really want six nipple covers? You're like, yes I do, thank you. And then Sunny. It's a pair of Three. It's three times two, two you know, because I have two boobs. Wait, let me check your math. Sonny had him on his fingers as rings. <laughs> How did he do that? He wrapped them around his finger? No, they're kind of sticky and he just like plopped them on top. He's like, I'm a ring. <laughs> I was like, go to bed. All right, stop scratching my face. He scratched my face. <gasps> on purpose or was it an accident? He was like playing, but like he scratched my face on purpose. And then we had a discussion about like how to rough house in a nice way. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a fine line. He's learning. Cause I can tell after he does something, he looks at you like that with that uh-oh face. Right. And I feel like he understands that there will be consequences. Good, good. Yeah, good. as good. he should. Yeah, otherwise he'd just be like a raging freak running through the world doing things without caring about the consequences. <sighs> like scratching people's faces off. I'll and like, never have a child like that. When's the pool gonna go down? I thought it was gonna go down sooner. Um, it stank really high. Stank? <laughs> The girl, the girl, this girl wrote a, um... Who's the girl, the girl? The <laughs> That's a cool, like, Instagram handle or new company called The Girl, the Girl. The the girl. girl. <laughs> you guys, let's call, let's start something called The Girl, The Girl. <laughs> the Girl, The Girl. Makeup. This girl who wrote an article for birdie.com about the line talked about my, um... KGs? KGs, yeah. KGs? <laughs> well, you are so KG. <laughs> What did she say? That it was the most adorable thing that's ever happened? She just wrote it out and then like alluded to it. Like she said something. Oh, that clears put, it up. Put like a G in. <laughs> Stop. Just, just, go just roll the show. Just roll the show seriously. Heidi was maybe going to come over and do this with us. Oh yeah, what happened? I wrote her back and then she never wrote me back. So um, we'll see. We'll see if she wants to do it. But what's interesting is that she wanted to come over and film a reaction video and we were like, that's kind of amazing. Like you guys <laughs> would love that. Yeah. We'll see what she says. I asked her, I said, do you feel comfortable commenting on the TV show? Cause like, I assume <laughs> that she knows that that's what we do. <laughs> well, we're filming. I think she does. But anyways, Heidi, if you're out there and you haven't read my text message yet, let's check know. it out. Check out your text. Check out your text. Where are we at in the hills world. I don't know, but good thing for us, they do a previously on. Oh, it's a little like recap on. in case you forget. And then you're like reminded, you're like, oh, right. Spencer and Heidi are having um, issues. You know, the recaps nowadays have become so long that it makes you feel like sometimes you, you don't even have to watch episodes. But don't you want to watch the episodes? Sometimes. Let's <laughs> into it, the franchise. Right. All right. Previously on The Hills. Oh, yeah. Whitney was doing great at her new job at People's Revolution. Celebrity outreach? Working on that. Okay, it's a little late. It's just that too late. That was supposed to be your responsibility, Jessica. No, and I have been working on that.
If that happened in a real workplace setting, I would go pull the girl in purple aside after the meeting and be like, what do you think? That like, was awful. Why call me out like well, that? Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Kelly was in the middle of calling me out. You had to, like, double down. It was not nice. They obviously had some other issue. Oh, and for the record, I have no idea if she was on drugs. I completely made that up. And people thought it was serious. Like, I knew her. Like, I don't know her. No. It was a complete joke. Robin an aren't there women celebrities that we can reach out to? Good thinking. <laughs> And they had asked me to help out with LA Fashion Week. You weren't there the first time I met Kelly Stone, were you? No, but I got a crying phone call. Heidi had reached out to Audrina. Hey, my name is Donna. Audrina promised me that she wasn't going to become friends with Heidi again. But Heidi may be having other ideas about their new friendship. Hi, um, I'm here to see Adrena. She's gonna be in the Epic Digital, which is straight ahead. Okay. And it's on the first floor. Okay. Right through those doors. Great, thank you. This is so cute. It's like a real cafeteria. Do people come like visit people at work? Do you eat here every day? Not, Not really. Every day. <laughs> like, um, there's a couple places down the street, but they usually have good food here. It's so nice to like relax and be able to have like a lunch. It wasn't that much to eat around there. Going nonstop. Like you don't know how nice it is to be able to talk to you again. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like we were friends for a long time mm -hmm. and then all this stuff happened that had nothing to do with us. I it had know. to really do with Lauren and Spencer. I know, and then you know? somehow all of us, it became right. part of all of us. And I was back and like, what am I do? This is none of my business, like, right. you know? I'm really like gaining myself again and I'm gaining like, Hanging out with girlfriends and like, okay, you know what? I really need a girls' night out. No boys, no Spencer. Will you come? Uh, uh, um, yeah, wonder that that invitation <laughs> sounded like something that happened in a recording studio. <laughs> Oh, look at that, oh, look at that star. <laughs> Cabs. Oh, what? Wow. So quiet. <laughs> Help get wet. Them damn <sighs> I can't even believe it. So, oh God, Audrina's actually going to go out with her. But Lauren forbade it. But Audrina's starting to, um, like, make conscious decisions to hang out with Heidi. So... They had lunch in the cafeteria. Yeah. <gasps> Whoa, what's this? Model casting. Model casting. <gasps> Hi, come here. Oh, come here. We're please, working, please. okay? I need you. I need you. <gasps> oh, lousies, lousies. I don't know, she, some, she goes like in and out. Was oh, she upstairs right now? I think so. Okay, so here's what's happening. Put yourself down over here and then I'll tell you what's going on. Bianca Gomez, how old are you now? Oh my God, you look so cute in that lingerie. Right. Hi, Kelly, this is Lauren, the helper. Hi, I met you before. The helper. I did meet you before, I'm well. Is she our helper? Yeah. She is? All right, Lauren, you want to cast with me? Sure. Me, Whitney, get ready, here we go. Her from there. Okay, go ahead. Straight down. Uh, Lauren, um, Whitney, can you Polaroid these two girls? All right. One, two, three. What's your name? Courtney. Courtney with a C? Thank you. All right. We've got another one, Lauren. Don't get too comfortable. Oh, my God. Ooh, that chick had crazy abs. <laughs> Lauren Conrad, where are you? Getting paper clips, getting paper okay. clips. Okay, I need to book these models. You guys have that done? Oh, my God. You guys are so slow. <laughs> I kind of can like vividly remember yeah, her saying yeah, that to us. To okay. Can you guys grab a couple chairs just to have a, like a little crash course really quickly? Can we spare Lauren to maybe call? Julia wants to make sure no. that the models... No, you could do that. We're going to book these models over here. Okay. Yeah. Lauren, pull up a chair over Absolutely here. Absolutely not. Oh my God. Wait, we know that guy. That is f***ing Erica Jane's creative director. Oh <laughs> I got that. I mean, I've watched many seasons of Beverly Hills Housewives. Lauren, pull up. Ah! Ah! There he is. With the chin strap. 
chair over here. Okay. Oh. Jessica, you can't sit here right now because we're booking the models, okay? We're doing a crash course in booking Give models. Give me your seat. Also, can you take your shoes off? I'm gonna need your shoes. Yeah, I need your shoes now to book these models. No, you don't need shoes. You wear your shoes later. <laughs> Great. Jessica's like, I love the way this turned out for me. <laughs> oh, Brad? Oh, perfect time. I'm just cutting your half. Thank you, but I'm leaving. All right. Oh my God. Enter Stephanie Fang. Enter. This half is for you. This half is for me. Well, that's this nice. Where are you going? Anywhere? I'm going out in Hollywood. Beautiful eyes. I'm sure you are. Do I do a nightclub? Uh, yeah. What club would that be? It's S bar. It's Heidi mm -hmm. So I'll take that as a yes. Don't wait up. Have fun, couch potato. Damn it. So she's not supposed to be hanging out with Heidi? She's, yeah, because he and Heidi are having a thing right now. They're not sure where they're at. And they're hanging out with Audrina. He doesn't know that. Did you ever go to Aspar? Yes. 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 Bar. Yes bar. Did you have any good insight into S bar? S bar was more of like a lounge. It wasn't like a nightclub, more loungy, as you can see by the candelabras in the background. And it just had little banquet around the perimeter of it and what bar. I mean, Audrina is disobeying Lauren's big time. Spencer sticks. Oh my God, is he gonna come to S Bar? I don't see it happening. Oh. He hasn't been out of an apartment. To it, you know, you think that you just like. When was the last time you did a scene not in an apartment? I mean, the last thing I can think about was Colorado. Right, he, he can only film in the apartment or other states. Slap <laughs> on an outfit no. and just like throw him out there, and it's no. not like that. This is like a dream job. I'm so stoked for you. It'd be so cool to work here with you. I know. We're kind of... Well, if you impress Kelly, maybe she'll hire you. Hey, you guys, I want to, hi. I want to oh, yeah. go over a couple of things, first of all. <laughs> She's like, hi, are you guys are you guys talking on my time? Okay, can you stop doing that? I'm going to bark at something at you now, okay? For the shows, it's just best to wear all black, no boobies, you know, just straight Am black. Am I doing No shows? short skirt. I'm going to need you to help us. Because yeah, I'm open all week. I just didn't know what I was doing. Tomorrow really is going to be all hell's going to break loose. So I really need you to get a good night's sleep tonight. It's going to be a big day, all right? Are we going to go out? I hope so. You need to get sleep. Oh, right, this is nighttime. They're already at S bar. Character, their like icon is so weird. He's my roommate. <laughs> Nothing is creepier than like. How old are you? Yeah. <laughs> I want to check the legality of yeah. possible uh, sex with you. Not to me. Uh, not me. I got two for you. Are you sipping on shots? Well, you can take yours and watch. You're kidding me. You're kidding me. Like, you come here on my girl's night, and you start flirting with girls, like, I want to smash your face in. I'm so mad. Take it in one, big shot. All right, you can sip it. You can still be rude when other people are sipping. You're taking shots. You're taking shots. You're taking shots. You're taking shots. <laughs> <laughs> 
Do you think it would matter to her that Spencer's just sipping the shot, though? Like, it's not that bad? <laughs> it's like what really pisses her off is that they're taking shots. She's like, they're taking shots. They're, like, shots, they're are shots. shots are our thing. <laughs> We do shots at Don Antonio's and at home. They're taking shots. They're taking shots? <laughs> are they take Stephanie, wipe your f***ing bangs out of your eyes and yeah. tell me if they are taking shots. <laughs> Girls night does not go well. repeats what she says uh -huh, a lot. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I can't tell how much of that was produced. Well, I can give you some insight. Please, please do. Please I think, do. I think you know, they're like him moving out, that stuff wasn't produced, but now the things that they're doing for the show are starting to really piss, piss one, one another one off. off. Yeah. And then I can guarantee almost that like the girls walking by and giving those dirty looks was the result of some producer being like, why don't you just go like, go walk by. by. I check them out. <laughs> Laundry. It's a laundry day for me. Mm. Where'd you go last night? Oh. Um, um, I went to S Bar after work. Heidi and Stephanie were there, like girls' night out. So then we're sitting there talking. Spencer shows up. And no, no, no. She's like, yeah, no, wait. No, what? no, I know that that's juicy <laughs> drama, but what were you doing yeah. hanging out with someone I forbid you Audrey to has... hang out with? <laughs> she's just hoping she's keeping going so right. that she doesn't help, like, she doesn't stop She's her. like, no, I told you, but you already forgot. Yeah. <laughs> and, like, Heidi kept looking over there, and Stephanie's like, oh, my God, like, what? What are you gonna do? Such Why wouldn't she just night. go up and say hi? Wasn't the guy like her fiance? Because like he knew that she was doing a girls' night with her girls, and like she's like, I bet he knew where I was coming, and he's just like stalking me and coming here. And then, but like, if you're so, in a relationship with someone, you can't walk up to them and be well, like, I guess hey. they're on relationship vacation. I don't know. Thing is, you weren't supposed to be there. And this is just me being me. That um, it would not surprise me if Heidi or Spencer tried very, very hard to become friends with you because. They really don't like the fact that I get along with Stephanie. Mm. Mm -hmm. I know. Yeah. Cool. They God it forbid was... they actually like me for me. Right. But oh. Okay, Lauren. Surprisingly gross though how many girls are on him. He probably pays them. No girl would willingly touch that scum. Oof. Whoa, where'd that come from? <laughs> Thank you, Lauren. <laughs> okay, let's go get ready. I have Kelly's show today. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I'll get mad at you for this later. Ugh. Smashbox is in Culver City. Mercedes Benz sponsored New York Fashion Week and LA Fashion Week. And now um, they still do some Fashion Week in New York, but there's no more LA Fashion Week. Not even because of COVID, just because it wasn't uh, taken as seriously. Mm -hmm. End of an era. All right, here's what I need you to do. I want you to push like a mother hen, okay. just from the back, both She's of you. She's not wearing back. Call these people out. Here's okay. the microphone. Okay. Get all the models. I'll In show line. you how to do it. Girls, we don't have time for this. Let's go out, out, out on the runway. That's how you do it. Just like a like a sheep herding dog. Okay. okay? No, I, I can't do that. I can't. Okay, models, everybody to the runway. Models. models out to the runway. You did it. Okay. Okay. All the girls out on the runway. Whitney, get the CD chart. I have it. 
Do you guys want to come out a little more? She's going to demonstrate for okay. you. Hi. Whitney, can you just go backstage really quickly and ask, does she want to go to red backstage lighting and then change to the purple for the first look? You copy that? OK. Does she, yeah. She wants to know, she's been talking, if she wants it to start red and then change to purple when the first look comes out. Alexia wants to know. Kelly wants to know. Like the lighting red? Red to purple? Okay. I'm sorry, I think that's Yeah, no, 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 I'm sorry. Did you want to start red? Did you want to start the first look red and then change to purple? Do you want to start purple? red. Right, OK. I'm like, I can't wait for you to ask her. I'm just going to go ask right. her. You got to be was, proactive. This yeah. girl's just not trying to get you the answer to your question. Well, the designer at the backstage of these shows is obviously like crazed, mm. right? Like they're focusing on all the looks and finishing touches and like sewing things. And then they're getting interviewed by press. Mm. And so it's really hard to like wrangle them, but they have to also make all the decisions. And so she, I... She just needed to know. You didn't have time. You gotta, gotta know, man. There. Yeah. Lighting's important. Yeah, sorry, Jessica. I don't have time for your drug problem. <gasps> oh my god. You guys, I'm kidding. I don't know Jessica. I don't know Jessica. I don't know Jessica. <laughs> I'm just gonna go deep red. Go deep. Can I see a red so I can lock it in? Let's bring the other house lights down. Okay, perfect. I love to okay, vest girl, look go over a dress. Okay. All right? Yes. All right. Don't f*** up. Don't f*** up. Yeah. So I'm changing the layout for APLA a little bit. I want to switch this one out to here and move this cabana out completely, which Kimberly. we have a week, so no. perfect. It was a joke. I kind of, like you were calling her bangs, but it was obviously a joke. <laughs> I thought you were like, yeah, duh, her name's Kimberly. Like you've been calling her Kimber. I've been calling her Elodie and Kimber. Here we go. Let's um, do Heidi. I know, I've been kind of hiding out a little bit. It was like the worst night of my life last night. That S bar? Yeah, I thought I was having like girls' night out, and then I said, thanks for the invite. Yeah. And he doesn't come over and say hi. Like he doesn't even acknowledge my existence. And then he's surrounded by like a group of girls and taking shots with them. I was so sick, and I wanted to kill them. I've never felt so betrayed. Was he trying to do some childish display of him being angry with the fact you guys or are on a bit of a it. break? You know, he's not over it. He's definitely You're not over it. it. You don't do something like that. It's so hard seeing him with other girls, so how can you love and hate someone so much at the same time? Major question. It's passion, man. Wait, don't want to let it slip away. I want to hold on sometimes. Oh, I'm still at the office. Blackberries are officially done. Mm. What are you doing? What are you doing? I have a sun out. <laughs> you guys, I'm a sun out. Hello. Spencer, I just, shots are our thing. Yeah, I'm calling for my iPhone too. Is that what they called it? What were the first models called? My iPhone S. It was probably just called the iPhone, right? I'm calling you for my new, yes, Apple. You know, Apple, <laughs> the computer company, they make phones now. And then he was like, I was just sipping shots. She's like, it doesn't matter. Tequila is for us. I am just at Bolt House. Do you want to come by? I think we need to talk. Uh, yeah, when should I come? Uh, whenever you can make it. Alright, bye. <laughs> He's like, I'm in a good mood. Yeah, I'll be there soon. He always sounds like the Joker or like something. Whitley. Whoa. Oh my god, what's that guy's name? Jason Schwartz? 15 minutes. We're gonna start the show. You're gonna be backstage with me and you're gonna help me push the models, and then Lauren's gonna help with the model lineup. Those models that came in late, we've gotta get them into first look so that we can start the show. Alright, guys, let's get in order. If models are done changing, please send them up front. We're gonna start lining up. Michelle! I just did a lap and no one caught it. 
Michelle. Okay. Right. Get up. Lauren. Two minutes left on all of us. Guys, is everyone lined up and ready for first look? What time is it? Is everybody lined up? We're ready. Are we ready? Is everyone lined up? We love a fashion show on this show. This is like the 80 billion fashion show. And I'm pushing again. You're pushing with the other girl. Oh, my God. Oh, Kirstie Alley. <laughs> Shocker that LA Fashion Week got canceled. Couldn't even fill up the, the, the photographer, photographer pit. I found out why there are so many photographers. Because they're all there on behalf of the different outlets? No. Why? They're there, oh, maybe. Well, the comment said that it's cheaper to hire your own photographer than it is to like lice, like buy the photos back from like the magazine who mm -hmm. took the pictures. Mm -hmm. So all the magazines are there and all the designers hire their own photographers, I think. To, oh. Yeah. <laughs> Fashion inside. Well, no, like basically. Mm, classic, well, no. So, who, what, where, for instance, like they'll send a photographer to go take the photos instead of having to purchase them from the designer. Right. And then the designer will also have photographers. They don't have to purchase yeah. the photos from who, what, where. But they'll just have a, they'll, f the designers just have a one photographer. They don't have like a bunch. Same page? Same page. Do you want to like out expert me here? No, 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 no. I mean, right. I, I could. I'm just re I'm just re reiterating a comment I heard on on uh, our YouTube channel. I appreciate the insight. Cool. Nobody talks about fashion, but when <laughs> and Kelly. Oh, Jessica, can you stand actually in the back? We need you. Yeah, still take your shoes off. What kind of walk was that? That model did like a full wide turn. This is embarrassing. Oh, it's LA Fashion Week, man. Canceled. Oh my god, do you have a pebble in your shoe? Right here. Faster! That's what I would be doing. He's screaming. You can't scream at the models yeah. on the runway. Yes, you can. Stick my head out there. Hold us! Everybody go! Everybody go! Everybody go! Everybody go! Yes. Get it. Get it. Oh, also Holis. Remember Holis? She's on a show now called, uh, I don't know, some other fashion show in an episode. Oh, has, where a you're designer. like, where's Holis? Uh, where's Holis? No, she was a model and now she's on like a Netflix show called like oh, Nirvana or something. Oh, cool. Oh, Kirstie Alley's loving it over there. <laughs> I had to, when I worked at VH1, I had to do a whole segment <laughs> on Kirstie Alley and like, <laughs> like my job was to gather all the footage of her uh -huh. that, that we would license to make like the little segment about Kirstie Alley. <laughs> and you search for her name in this like, software and I couldn't find anything for like months and like I was like not telling my bosses about it and I realized her name is not Christy Alley. It's Kirsty. It's Kirsty. Yeah, yeah, the R's in a different place. Yeah. So check your spelling and shit. You uh, were researching it for months and didn't figure that out. No, and your bosses were mad for, at you for, for months. reeking out. They were like, why do we have no Kirsty Alley footage? And I was like, I can't fing find any. <laughs> what kind of face did you just make at me? <laughs> like, How do you spell her name? What's her name? Kirstie Alley. Well, I've been saying it a bunch. It's not really fair. Kirstie Alley was one of my favorite actresses when I was younger because I loved Look Who's Talking. I think it's Look Who's Talking. Look Who's Talking. Look Who's Talk, Inc. <laughs> it's like a workplace show about a talking company. Talk, Inc. Here we go. Have we ever did a reality show? Nope. We're back to pause. <laughs> yes, Whitney. A reality show about like... The company, it could be called Whitney Inc. I N G K or I N K. But Whitney Whitney Ing doesn't mean anything. <laughs> we'll work on this. I love you. Nice job on the music boys. Yeah, seriously, nice job, Whitney Whitley Cross. On the music boys. Kirstie Alley loved it. She's on drugs. Where's the after party? It's something about you! Ooh, Ooh car talks don't. This is a stupid car. He's like, hey, you look hot. Mm -hmm. Well, hello. Well, I wouldn't talk to you about last night. Oh, I'm not even to sit here and argue, because... You don't have to sit here and argue. Why'd you drive me? If you want to be single, then be single, but let me know. Um, you pretty much made me single when you... No, I didn't! 
Uh, you call it relationship vacation? Anyone else on planet Earth calls that breaking up? No, Fair. you don't. Yes, I call that a separation. Vacation. Relationship vacation is like... For her to not, like, at all understand why he might think that they're broken up seems not right. Yeah, agreed. Relationship. I mean, we were just fighting so much. We were fighting, we fought but twice. I wanted space. I wanted well, you got space. your space. Yeah, but I didn't want you like hooking up with other I didn't people. I'm not with, hooking I didn't up with other guys. With I was there with my friend, and you embarrassed me in front of everybody. I embarrassed you. Yes. Not out Okay. You know what? Next time I stand at a bar and there happens to be some guys there, and I'm flirting with them, flirting. taking shots. Let's see how you feel. Bottom line is, you're delusional if you think I was flirting with those girls. How long is relationship vacation? Like, am I supposed to not go to bars and not talk to people for how many months? I just don't think I can just keep waiting around all year long to wait for when Heidi decides she wants to get off relationship vacation. They need to decide if they're going to be together or not. They really do. Heidi really wants to be with him. I think they really want to be with each other. So they really parked on an angle there. Mm -hmm. People wanted to know when the fashion show is done, do you stay and clean up? Yeah, you stay in the you stay backstage and pack help pack up everything. But the wrap up is really quickly because usually another show is coming right away to like start setting up for the show. Mm -hmm. So you, it's yeah. You get your shit out of you, there. Exactly. Yeah. There's like another Kelly Catrone who, who tells everyone in her crew to only wear purple. And she's like, get out of here. Yeah. Old Catrone. But there's really only like backstage. There's really obviously just the makeup and hair and then the collection. So it's not, there's not that much stuff to, once the models are gone. Yeah, like, but we don't, we don't, like, take all the chairs down here. Like, that's part of the um, Smashbox. That's their job? Yeah. Hi. OMG, oh my God. No. OMG, oh my God. Uh, in case you didn't know what OMG stood for. Maybe at that point, no one did. Kelly is, so, uh, oh, here comes an awkward high five. Let's oh my God, she land. loves a high five. Look. <laughs> to play. Nope, no, it did not. No, it did not. She needs to look at the elbow. <laughs> So do I. Yeah, my mom would be so proud. Okay. And Lauren, you've gone from like slow mo to like fashion glow. An unbelievable two year increase. And um, we would love to offer you a physician to come and work with us. Seriously? We're happy to have you come on because we want to start making some changes in our LA office. Uh, you're gone. <laughs> That's so awful. I'm sure everybody out there has wristbands. I'm going, well, we have two. So. But she's talking about No, the, but I'm talking about the, this party the, before we go to the other oh, party. I didn't even know there was Can you? Yeah, there's one in the green room for Mercedes. And then can you get an assistant to get a taxi for my nanny and my daughter to get yeah. back? Okay, we'll just figure out the wristbands and then, okay. Oh. She was like trying to join in the celebration. They're like, yeah. actually, instead of celebrating with us because we have these new girls here, can you go do some menial sh before I fire you next week? Ugh. Awful, no. awful. Thank you so it's much terrible. for showing up and helping us out. And we're happy to have you come on. You know, it's an amazing opportunity. Uh, looking Look at, at the camera all the time. It's an amazing opportunity for me to get some um, press for my company on yeah. the TV show. Exactly. You're cute and tall. <laughs> I'm cold. malnourished. He just don't look well. No, it's not, because I stopped going back to Jason. I just feel so comfortable. We were such good friends before she moved in with Lauren. I'm down, whenever. It's up to this one, though. I need to leave this table immediately. Yeah. Yeah. Thinking about getting a house. Have you guys already been looking? A little bit. Kind of. Do you know what you're going to do yet? Oh. Oh. Yeah, kind of. We're thinking about um, just not living with you anymore. <laughs> How do you feel about that? Yeah. She ends up, she moves in with them. Yeah, and it's a whole problem. It is. No, hit this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so many good clicker vibes. <laughs> Great I, episode, actually. 
Was it? That was a good episode. I had fun. I was just thinking about being sore. I did a crazy Melissa Wood Health yesterday where it was a dance warm up and mm. my thighs are on fire. Mm. All right. Well, let's um, talk about the show. Thank everyone. No, I like I like tidbits from your life. You know what I mean? I just, um, you know, you got a busy day. <gasps> But thank you. thank you guys for joining us. Um, really proud of you, babe, for Cozy Co. Oh and God, Annie. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm excited to see the house they move into. Yes, can't wait for Lo to try and steer Lauren away from Audrina in terms of friendship. <laughs> right. Like, peace. Subscribe, peace in the streets. And just peace. And just pe peace in the cyberland. Peace uh, everywhere. Anything else? Hannah, so do you want to take a little phone break? Yeah, phone break. Phone break. Bye.